aid, evil, temptation, poverty? This is the power of St. Martin and his holy word. See you around. Goodbye. What Wait is it? Sale, actually. Restoratives. The Chapel of the Divines in Cyrodiil will never turn a blind eye to those in need. Ring of Witches. Goodbye. Talk to you later. Ah, worship RK. Thank you, RK. Marcius Carve, Viscount Bruma. The title garners a lot of respect and a fair few privileges. Anyway, how can I help you? What does a Viscount do? As Viscount, I'm a sort of secondary count, if you will. I deal with a lot of the same duties as the Count, albeit deferring to him. Often, when the Count is busy with other matters, he delegates lesser affairs to me. What's going on in County Bruma? The usual, honest citizens, wild animals, bandits, all in one melting pot. That and stubborn Talos worshippers. They've always been a risk to Bruma since the Concordat. Old habits die hard. Have you accepted RK as your lord and savior? And what's it like being a Viscount? It's quite interesting. It also affords me a fair amount of respect. Being the Count's second in command is no mean feat. You wrote a book? Yes, an explorer's guide to Skyrim. Very popular in Skyrim. Seems to turn up in the most unusual of places. Until next time. I wonder if there's any undead down here in the catacombs. Man, they did a good job recreating the chapels from uh, Oblivion. Yeah, they recre recreated everything. Just to an exquisite detail. It looks just like them. It's so good. It always makes you wonder why, but like they they're trying to remaster Morrowind with with uh, a bunch of modders. Why not just hire that team? Put some Bethesda staff members on there too to give them access to stuff they wouldn't normally have. And then have them make the HD remake of, of Morrowind, and then but but Bethesda could sell it. I don't know. Get him on some contract work or something. By the synod, weary of the whispers, why not go somewhere more agreeable? Resort of the resplendent boutique of magical wonders. Hi, Resort of the resplendent, enchanter extraordinaire, illusionist incredible, restorer remarkable, and destructor distinguished at your service. Uh, got any work needs doing? Yes, indeed. To my great regret, a few scalawags here in Bruma appear to have not paid their bills for their enchanted weapons from Rosada. I am beside myself with angst about this, as you can no doubt imagine. So, my fair and, might I say, rather imposing friend, if you would be willing to speak to these scoundrels and acquire my warranted compensation, I would be most obliged. Uh... Okay. Excellent! Allow me to arm you with more knowledge of the aforementioned mischief makers. You'll need to speak with Roland Wickert, the young chap at the Synod Conclave here in Bruma. Stantis Valeria is the second of these reprobates, the owner of the Geraldview Tavern. The third is Stablemaster Ela the Upright, 
clearly the title was given rather than deserved. Do this for me, and I shall bestow coin upon you for each, and a truly copious recompense indeed once all three mischief makers are dealt with. Okay, um... Do you have a house or a bed? What an intriguing inquest! I do indeed have a bed. Well, a bedroll. I do not own property in Bruma, for the city is full, and I am somewhat of a latecomer. Ah, I know how that, that goes. And not being registered to any property grants the Synod and College of Whispers less opportunity to persecute, hound, maltreat, and um, <clears throat> molest me. What? As they are wont to do. What? Huh? Are you with Synod or the College of Whispers? Why, of course not. No self-respecting mage joins those scurrilous syndicates. Oh, my friend, I'm strictly independent. That's what allows me to cut out the bumbledom and bring you only straightforward sortilage. Okay. Let me brown your standard inventory. Oh, how mundane a soul you are. You could acquire commodities such as these from any charlatan. Very well. Take a look. Um... A lot of stuff, sir. I will take the soul gems, though. Wither. Reduce the target's movement speed and attack damage by 5% each second for 22 seconds. Hmm. That just seems pretty cool. Farewell. Goodbye, sir. I gotta do that as well. Oh, turn that one off. the blacksmith they had the letter for. Northern Arms. Hey, hey, hey. Hmm? At. Hey, hey. Sir. Hmm? I met your brother in Snow Snowstone Rest. He's fled the province. I... Do what? And what's that there? A letter he wrote for you here. I... I see. Cutters, huh? I swear, those damned bandits are getting bolder and bolder. they rule the entire county soon. I... Here. Have this. A little bit of coin. Least I can do. Here's hoping Avar can return here in time. Can I help you? I like training in smithing. Fire and steel, smoke and brimstone. That's the art of a blacksmith. Here, let me teach you. Hmm. The cost isn't what it's saying it is. Ah, 
fighting. Level up. Go step it up. I need one more point. Sure thing. Knowledge doesn't come free, though. I, I need a little more gold. Talk to you later. I'll be back in a minute. odd and you say it just appeared here out of thin air it isn't mine that's for sure where do you think it came from what is with this commotion where did that come from who made this mess that's the thing we don't know it just appeared out of thin air maybe that stranger over there has something to do with it you there come here me Hi. You there. Are you the cause of this mess in my conclave? What mess? Don't play ignorant with me. You are involved in this somehow. I mean, really. You expect me to believe that you just happened to randomly walk in just as this statue appeared here? I actually had nothing to do with it. Really? You genuinely have no idea what I'm talking about? Hmm. You may be telling the truth. Or you may not be. I suppose we'll just have to wait and see. Well then, I apologize for the inconvenience. Welcome to the Bruma Synod Conclave. Attendant, clean up this mess, would you? And take that statue to the back for examination. Uh, yes, first adjunct. Sir? I'm Roland Wickert. D uh, hello? I'm here to click payment for Rosada. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I completely slipped my mind. Uh, here you go. As it is, I Thank don't exactly you. have the time for trifles such as this. You seem like a helpful fellow. Would you be willing to help discover the source of this mysterious object? If so, let me know. I could use someone of strong wit and not merely of strong arm. Oh. Sir. Good day to you, Cadius. Welcome to the Bruma Synod Conclave. You had a How job for me? You? Involving an alien ruin? As you noticed when walking in, a couple of seemingly random items have been appearing in the Conclave of late, and I'm not quite sure as to why. Given that, as you can no doubt imagine, the Conclave is very busy, I am willing to hire external agents to look into this. What do you want me to do? After the first item appeared, I had one of the attendants, Attendant Wickard, take it back to the study area for examination. Check with him and see if he's discovered anything. Alright, looks like we might go to an alien ruin. How can I help? Uh, Cadius wants to, uh... Know if you found anything unusual about the statue. Anything unusual? Uh, well, it's hard to tell, to be honest. I'm not exactly the most experienced mage in this area, but... But what? But I did notice that it looks an awful lot like an alien design. Haven't you seen the massive statues by the entrances of their ruins? I also know that alien statues this portable and small would be very valuable, and therefore would probably all have been scavenged from the ruins. Why would an alien artifact appear in the Conclave? My theory? I think someone sent it here as a test. Someone who has access to valuable artifacts such as this, that they plan to come get it back. I think someone is going to try teleporting here using the same teleportation uh, uh, technique. We should... 
I'm going to continue studying this thing. You might want to tell Caddius that this doesn't seem to be stopping anytime soon. Black Soul Gym? What is going on? I like to think of philosophy as a way of conclusively resolving the big questions in life. Or is it? The it's tale not... of the great moth priest hunt. That's Can something I I'd want to read. Can you teach me spells? Destruction spells? Uh, no, not really. If you really want to learn, you'd have to join up with us before I can show you what I know. Nobody here is even allowed to teach you the advanced stuff, though. Synod or not, it goes against regulations. Not that I've really reached the advanced stage yet myself, anyway. What do you know about the College of Whispers? I think the same as everyone else around here about them. Mm hmm Which is... That they're another magical organization that the Synod have no standing relationship with. What do you do here? Me? I'm the resident destruction expert here. Well, if you want to call me an expert, but I wouldn't. I'm still learning, honing my craft, as they say. My ultimate goal is to perfect the art of defensive spellcasting. I want to be able to conjure the raw power of combative forces of nature and beyond at will. Uh, but that'll have to come later. <laughs> Hopefully sooner later, rather than later later. Yes. Let it make you powerful. Do it. Okay, well... Embrace the power. Have you learned anything more about our little perplexity? Roland is still studying the statue. Then what are you talking to me for? It seems more items are appearing. By the eight. Maybe we can take advantage of this. Search the conclave. Look for anything that seems out of the ordinary and bring it here. Maybe by examining the items, we can determine their origin. Search the Brumus and Conclave for strange items. Like, could I have those fire salts? I want the fire salts. I remember there was a mod that added uh, fire effects to, to salts like that. They would like burn a little bit. I forget which one it was. So like fire salts would glow. It like burn a little bit. Ice ones would be cold. Search for, for strange items. Like like what? what would be strange? Probably stuff like lying on the ground. Okay, the god of death and birth. Yeah, I don't see anything. So let's look upstairs. Upon opening, it becomes clear this book has been weathered and torn uh, through the harsh grips of time. It's still intact, but some pages are start remain legible. As I pin this, I gaze upon the walls of my home. Remember the very days its design came to fruition. Although it seems like yesterday, it was actually many years coming with up with the design for my home, a place where I practice my magic and peace, keep myself away from prying eyes of my colleagues. I poured over tomes, spelling error, uh, and dusty scrolls, scoured the bookshops of the land, even delved into ancient ruins, looking for Twitch Prime. I'm looking for inspiration. Finally, as I rested my weary body at a camp outside of Bruma and marveled in awe at the majesty of the Gerald Mountains, I became inspired like a magician. I inspired like a madman. I began to skit. Thank you for subbing Rage Battle 1. Switch with Twitch Prime. Then still Maniac. Thank you for 100 bits. And deleted. Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Okay, a step back to see what I wrought. Frostcrack Spire was born. 
and now an age of oh, age overwhelms me, and the glow is dying from my eyes. I wish contains many wonderful inventions. Spent my whole life perfecting them, and I hope you'll put them to good use. Uh, my pride and joy is the Atronach altar. By bringing these salts from the very same creature to this altar, you can summon Atronach familiar to do your bidding. It will obey. Created portals of all the mages' guild in Cyrodiil. This should make it easier to travel to them from the times of need. Fuse with the stone and mortar. May your journeys be safe and the roads you travel free of danger. This is the Frostcrag Spire uh, book. When you get the Frostcrag Spire, it like it lets you uh, do all the stuff that it says on there. <coughs> hmm, that looks out of place. I can't click on it though. Mysterious Soul Gem. Uh, oh my god, Black Horse Courier! We love the Black Horse Courier. Oh, Oblivion. It's still running all these years later. <laughs> that thing is so bright over there. Some nice looking weapon in there. Uh, Skyrim takes place hundreds of years after Oblivion. They do the hundreds of years between each game so that way, like. What they is it? It's easier to write stuff and get away with like slight inconsistencies if it's hundred of years later. So that way there's no like overlapping characters and stuff. Hmm, I don't see anything else. Any other items around. Except that, but I can't click on it. If it's broken, I feel like I should be able to click on it, but it won't let me. I feel like it's glitched. Do you mind? That's a Wayland stone, but I can't click on it. I'm pretty sure it's one of the items. There's a boot. Mysterious boot. How do you get that low? I just had to try to. I thought it was maybe. It was like glitched in the floor of the hitbox. So it looks like this guy's items are. Like the wizard is sort of just sort of. Slowly teleporting into this realm. One item at a time. anything more about our little perplexity here's all the new items that have appeared give them here 
Let's see what they can tell us. Here's a soul gem. Not just any generic form of soul gem. This is a black soul gem. Only two types of people use these. Murderers and necromancers. This certainly isn't an item which carries with it a positive stigma. What else? I tried to cast it myself. And it didn't quite cast the way you Here's a book, a boot. Fairly common, but it seems familiar for some reason. This almost seems like the type of boot I would wear. Intriguing. What else? Don't you worry. We'll find a good secluded area of the later to practice. A book? Weathered memoirs, eh? This seems to be a journal of some sort about the creation of Frostcrag Spire. Well, this is an interesting twist in our little mystery. Before we examine this further, I'd like to see any other artifacts which may have appeared. Mm -hmm. That's all of them. These told me a lot, thank you. One thing is certain. Whoever these items belong to is affiliated with the magical arts. More specifically, the darker side of the magical arts. It would also seem that our mystery mages have some connection with Frostcrag Spire. What can you tell me about Frostcrag Spire? Is it only five dollars still? Haven't you seen that large tower in the mountains off in the distance? That is Frostcrag. It was supposedly erected back in the late third era by some old mage with too much time on his hands. Quite the sight, isn't it? It would probably still be of great interest to the Synod too, were it not sealed off many years ago by its last residents. I'm not quite sure what part the spire plays in the summoning of these mysterious objects, yet. We shall see. Well, that was... We should check out Frostcrag's spire, then. You're actually only half right. You see, now that I have at least some idea who's behind this, I'm restricting this investigation. The Synod appreciates all your help in solving this little enigma, but at this point... Wait, what's that? Oh, not again. What the? Who's there? What the? What's going on here? The hell is that? Such a formidable insect bite. It's a zombie. Oh, God. Who made that noise? Ow, ow, ow. 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 Why are they attacking that guy? Wait a minute. Shit, one of her one of the spells hit them. God damn it. One of the spells accidentally hit one of the mages, so the companions are fighting the, them. Ah, oh, I hate bugs like that. <laughs> okay. Have you learned anything more about our little... Give them here. Let's see what they can... Not just... This, uh, what else? Fairly co what else? A book? This seems- Before we examine this further, these told more specifically, the darker side- Haven't- It was- It would- I'm not quite sure what part the spire plays in the summon- We in the brew- I shall say- Wait, what's that? Oh no- Okay, save. Again! Who's there? There you are. Takes care of that. Okay. Are we good? This is madness. I am sick and tired of these intrusions. It would appear that your services are again required before payment can be rendered. I cannot simply step back and allow this to continue. Not now that there is a tangible threat to our hall. I, we, must act. Go to Frostcrag Spire and do whatever is necessary to put an end to these infuriating escapades. I just hope that the college isn't somehow involved in this. 
The vines know they live to make trouble for us. Investigate Frostcrack Spire. <gasps> we get to go back to Frostcrack Spire from Oblivion. Yay! What in Oblivion are you doing? Nothing. Yes, I mind. Yeah, this this uh, DLC is quite good, even better than some Bethesda stuff. You know, not everything part of it's great. Some some parts are a little shaky, but most of the time it's really good. Yeah, like the recreation of the world is just amazing. The art, the three D artists have done a wonderful job. They did such a good job recreating uh, Oblivion environments. streaming a new. Oh dear God. Oh. 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 To which it is streaming. Oh. 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 Love. Damnable tavern! Damnable owner! How dare he allow that lizard to engage in such a salacious display! Scandalous! Uh, Benator wants you to drop oh, the charges. The ha! That isn't this going to happen, I'm afraid. I am distressing the customers. What's your problem with the restful it's watchman? Said, it's a dingy yes. squad filled with criminals, rats, and lice. You are, the amount of underhanded you, you deals dare. and crooked business that goes on there, you. it beggars I belief! Outrage! I want it to land in hot in water, water with our dear so guard He deserves it, no? You Say, would you help me with that? I'm done with you, standards. And I'm done with this shoddy excuse for a What exactly should I help? Why exactly should I help you? You should help me because the tavern is filled with criminals. They deal with bandits. They steal. They rob. Surely it's only right that they face justice for what they do. How dare you insult All right, that sounds like what I would do. Excellent. No, As it so happens, I'm a mage by because trade. I, I have access to many magic items from my home of Alanor. And I'm Take this. It's a very special memory gem. I have one access at all times. Himself. And this particular one recorded everything that happened in the tower that night. Take it your and let the guard captain listen to it. Irrefutable evidence. And to that, I I'm say sure he'll see fit to take good. action then. Talk to you later. Day. Away with you, Rube! What the? <laughs> what was he talking okay. about? Did you change the linens like I asked? I sell the finest horses in Bruma. Well, the only horses in Bruma. But nevertheless, the finest. I'm here to click payment for Rosada. Ah, yes. The enchanted horse hay he sold me. What a joke. The only thing magical about the hay was that it caught on fire. Very easily. My horses clippity clop over it and boom, it goes up in smoke. Nearly burnt down my stable. But what about the coin? Well, I managed to get some use out of it as a way of getting rid of pests. Pretty fun to use, too. 
but he did hide. still swindle me. Or maybe High Rock. Here, take the coin back to Rosada, but tell him to check that his enchanted items actually do what they say they do next time. Okay. Hi there. Looks like you've got some sort of sickness. Here to collect pan for Rosada. I'm sure you are. I purchased one of Rosada's. What did he call them? Pleasure candles? <laughs> yeah, that's it. He said it would make the customers enjoy their Geral view experience more. In reality, it just clogged the nose. So much so that a few of my regulars nearly choked to death. So, no, I don't think I'll be giving him his money. I'm just the messenger. Please don't complicate things for me. Oh, I suppose. It would be fairly short-sighted of me to complicate your responsibilities any further because of Razada's questionable product. Fine, here's the coin. But deliver my complaint to Razada. I will. Come, warm yourself by the hearth. Heard any rumors? I heard the city guard are trying to crack down on smuggling. Been too many illicit goods making their way to Skyrim from here. Empire doesn't like it one bit. Any other rumors? Jaden Hall's overflowing. Aftermath of the Red Year. Adius Vilius has been walking around looking flustered lately. You know, Captain of the City Watch. Not sure what's got him in such a knot, though. I heard the general store, Icewind Traders, got robbed by the Khajiit, Dartakto. Or so Cetus says. Any other rumors? There's a Thalmor agent here in Bruma, making sure no one violates the Concordat. So I'd advise you not to, if you don't want them to slap you in irons. Been to Bruma's Synod Conclave? Useless quacks, the lot of them. Well, Elintius is a nice guy, at least. I mean the organization. They refuse to lift a finger for anyone who isn't a high-ranking member. Need any work done? As it happens, yes, I do. I need the shipping request delivered to Greenwood. My regular courier is unavailable. If you're able to act in his stead, I'll reward you with coin. All right, I'll do it. Excellent. Take this to offer for Malius at Greenwood, down where the Geralds meet the Great Forest. I'll deliver payment on your return. Looking for bounties, any leads? There is something, actually. Here. The powers that be at the county castle sent out this bounty letter. Ooh. How's business? Business at the Gerald View is always good, due to our exceptional standards for customer service. We strongly believe that if you build it, they will come. Good movie. Any other rumors? He'd seem to have no everything. Realm Tay has been complaining about some noise nuisance. Talks my ear off about it. Probably that damnable bard, Renard Eventoned. Ever been to such? Should consider it. I hear it's absolutely picturesque. Went to head there myself, but no time, running the view and all. There's some trouble going on with the Jukanis. Family feud or something. Their arguments aren't exactly hard to overhear. Yep, for such. You ever hear the history of Cloud Ruler Temple? Of course you have. Used to be a home of the Emperor's Blades. Now it's all ruins and overgrowth. Sorry end for a glorious bastion of the Empire. Any other rumors? I hear the Count's cracking down on criminals in Bravo. About time. You know that bard? We're not even toned. Yeah. I hear the Jukanis paid him to watch over and entertain their kid, Banus, while they were out of town. See you what around. is it? Nothing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Name's Cedis Perusius, owner and proprietor of Icewind Traders here in Bruma. A diverse and wide range of supplies and sundries, all under one roof. What do I know? What do you sell? Why, my friend, surely the better question is, what don't I sell? I sell anything and everything, or thereabouts. How's business? Business is always good for a general goods merchant like myself. 
since I don't rely on any particular thing to draw in sales. Take poor old Fadal, the butcher, for example. If someone doesn't want meat, he doesn't have a customer. But me? Someone doesn't want meat. They want silverware. Don't want silverware. How about a potion? And so on and so on and so on. Such was a city cut from oblivion? Pretty late in development, so was it like mostly finished? What are the most popular items? Hmm, most things are very popular. The only thing that isn't popular is cutlery. Why is that? Turns out the Nords aren't all that big on table etiquette. <laughs> okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Excuse me, I'm sorry to bother. It's just that my most prized possession has gone missing, and I fear that without help, I'll never get it back. I normally wouldn't approach a stranger like this, but, well, I'm at the end of my tether. I could really use some help. Could I hire you? I could pay you handsomely. Uh, I need more information first. I... Okay. Give me a moment to compose myself. There is a priceless heirloom in my family that has been passed down throughout nearly my entire ancestry. As you may know, we Dunmer revere our ancestors greatly. Ancestry is incredibly important to our people. Therefore, you understand how important it is to me that my heirloom is returned. I am... Uh, my apologies, friend. This theft has left me quite flustered. I am so flustered right now. I'll help you. Excellent. Thank you. The heirloom has been stolen. Well, by all accounts, the thief fled to the northeast of Bruma. I suspect they're holed up in Frozen Grotto. If you are able to retrieve my heirloom for me, I'll be forever in your debt. Fine. Too many radiant quests. Do, 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 do. Oh, that one guy's in here, the uh, Khajiit. Oh, he's down in the basement. Yeah, we actually, uh, the game Radiant quested um, the Dawn Guard mission into the Bruma mod, which is interesting. Ah, another patron of this fine bathhouse. Oh, dear God. Please, come in, come in. Who oh, in oblivion told that guy he's a good singer? Oh, I've heard God. Deirdros do better. Hi there. What does this one want with Dartakto? Who is it you're complaining about? Oh, his name is Rina, I've even told. Damned fool apparently thinks he's the divine's gift to singing. He's terrible and he's loud. You can hear his terrible performances from the streets. It's getting very irritating. The beggar, Rante, has shown a particular interest in getting Rina to shut up for some reason. You could go speak with him. Perhaps he'd even pay you. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, that is Filler's mention you wanted your one for thievery? This one has been falsely accused of stealing from Icewind Traders, the general store. They tell him he has stolen their hides and that he is selling them at his stall. This is false. This one has done nothing of this sort. In, in fact, perhaps you could help. Adius Vilius is the captain of the guard here in Bruma. If you speak to him, perhaps he will change his mind. This one fears he considers him a dirty thief and will not hear his pleas. Um... All right, I'll speak to him. Thank you. May you eternally walk on the warmest, glistening sands. Uh, these pleasantries please you, yes? Then Khajiit will continue. The hell? Um, Serana, get the hmm? you're under the water. 
Is that even... Can you... What are you... This water is delightful. Truly delightful. Bathed yes. in murky waters. She's just lying on the ground. Delightful under the water. Waters, I don't know. Okay. Would be a true shame should they be. That is disturbing. <laughs> oh. Hi. Yeah, he, he's very specific. It's only murky water. It's not just any normal water. Not all Khajiits are thief. Lies. Razada the Resplendent greets you. How can my arcane ability and esoteric enlightenment help you on this fine day? That's all the payment, right? Indeed it is. <clears throat> Why are you looking at me like that? Go on, shoo. My reward? Ah, right. That uh, <clears throat> small matter almost slipped my mind. <laughs> Here. Take this spell tome. I came up with the spell myself, you know. <laughs> to conjure a zombie. Ooh. <coughs> I modified the standard spell to make it more effective. And I believe you will like the results. Disgusting. Ah, uh, That is sick. Profit. Okay. That's disgusting, though. It gave me a necromancy totem. Ugh. So gross. Excuse me, sorry to bother. I don't suppose you've seen any priceless Sakaviri heirlooms gallivanting around Broom, have you? I'm sorry, what? Sakaviri heirlooms. Priceless Sakaviri heirlooms. Seen any? No heirlooms, sorry. As I suspected, sorry to bother you, citizen. Just, uh, let me know if any do crop up, yeah? Thanks. Should we talk about the charges leveled against D Doracto? He's accused of stealing from Icewind traders. What of it? Ah, oh, wait. They don't tell me he roped you into having the charges dropped. He's been trying that tactic a lot recently. I have sympathy for the cat, being accused like this while the bigger fish went free. And what can I do? I have to enforce the law. Did you ever get evidence against Doracto? No, but Cetus made the accusation. I don't know what you expect me to do, but I can't just drop charges on a whim like this. Can you really arrest someone based on one person's word? I... You have a point. Your word, along with Dartoktos, is one more voice than Cetus has on his side. Very well. Consider the charges dropped. However, I'm afraid it does come with some strings attached. I can't drop charges like this and return things back to the way they were. Consider the charges dropped, but Dartocto will be evicted of residency in Bruma. No way I can get away with dropping these charges without people starting to ask questions about how fit I am to be guard captain. It's no secret he's a thief, but he's... well... 
He's about as close to a good thief as you can get without reading a children's bedtime story. Tell... Tell him I'm sorry. I was sort of fond of that cat. Khajiit. Oh. How strange to say that. Anyway, you should probably go tell Dr. Takto the bittersweet news. I'm here to uphold the law. I advise you not to break it. I have this memory gem. It's a recording of events of the Restful Watchmen. Oh, well, this should be interesting. Go ahead. Let's listen. What's all this about Akavari heirlooms? A whole lot of uproar about nothing, that's what. The Count's been nagging my life and soul out about the damn things. You see, the Carvanes have a sort of family tradition. They've acquired a taste for Akaviri artifacts, constantly collecting more and more. Been going on for centuries now. Well, it turns out poor old Count Desilus... <coughs> Count Carvane? Isn't too happy that his collection's been stolen. Can you use some help searching for them? I... Well, that's... Oh, who am I kidding? Absolutely. This is driving me crazy. Just bring them back to me when you found them, and I'll be extremely appreciative. And I mean extremely appreciative. Seriously. I feel like offing myself right about now. When and how were the artifacts stolen? I'm not too sure on the details of that, to be honest. Rignar, the castle steward, was the first one who noticed them missing. Might be worth speaking to him, if you think that's interesting evidence to dig up. This guy's got a really nice voice to listen to. Have any suspects? Not in particular. Then again, the low lives of Bruma don't exactly hide themselves all that well. The shadier tavern in town, and the restful watchman, full of thieves, bandits, thugs, and other miscreants, might be a decent place to start your search. How did the thief even get inside the castle? I have no idea how they'd manage that, honestly. Either adept stealth or good luck. Probably a bit of both. Why would the thief want artifacts? Monetary value or...? Almost definitely the resale value. Akaviri artifacts are very often one of a kind, and they can fetch a very high price to the right buyers. Someone possessing those artifacts could find themselves becoming very wealthy very quickly. I suspect that's the motive here. What exactly was stolen? Akaviri artifacts. I don't know anything more specific than that. Rignar and the Count both told me, but honestly it flew in one ear and out the other. If you want to know exactly what artifacts to keep your eyes peeled for, talk to Rignar. I'm sure he can help you more there. What's it like being Bruma's guard captain? It's tough. On one side, you've got criminals. The kind that like to hide behind law and policy to wriggle out of justice. On the other, you've got politics, constantly meddling in our affairs as everyone walks on eggshells. And here I am in the center, just trying to make things work for the people. Sometimes I wish I'd stayed down in the Imperial City. Politics often get in the way of your work? More than you might think. Between the Count, the White Gold Concordat, and all the other treaties, the rules are constantly changing. All I want to do is protect these people, jail criminals, earn my keep. And then the damned wind changes, and with it, the law. And then, what do you know, I'm supposed to jail this group, and that group, and the other group. And for what? For politics. Despite it all, though, I wouldn't trade this job for the world. It's rewarding. Fulfilling. And at least it lets me provide for myself and my family. You're from the Imperial City? Yep, me and my family. Wife and children are still there, in fact. Left because the place is swarming with people. Hard to find any work. Came up here, couldn't find much work either. Joined the guard on a whim. Saw a lot, rose to the ranks. And now I'm guard captain. Funny how things work out. I try to take my duties seriously, and send as much as I can back to my loved ones. Okay. See you. 
And then I need to do the memory thing. What's that snot-brained Altmer doing here? This is no place for one of them. You don't think he's Thalmor, do you? No, doesn't seem the sort. But he's still not the right type for our little den. Might bring the wrong kind of attention. So what do we do? Stabbing him would be... excessive, so... I know. Why don't we treat him to a little show of our favorite lusty Argonian maid? Perfect. Let's go fetch her. Here, take this coin. I'd like to buy a little show for my Altmer friend over there. Sure thing. Oh, one other thing. He wanted you to roleplay as Lifser Tail, you know, from... Ha, <laughs> Altmer. Always the same fantasy. Sure thing. Hey, darling. I heard you wanted a date with Lifser Tail. What is the meaning of this? Lifser Tail? What a ridiculous name for an even more ridiculous... Oh my! Xarxas's breath! What an oblivion are you doing? I demand that you put that back on! Ariel, give me strength! Cease and desist! I demand that you cease and desist at once, you cretinous lizard woman! Stop jiggling about! <laughs> I can't take this anymore! I think I'm going to faint! I think... Oh... Ha! <laughs> it worked! Otis, you really are a genius! <laughs> <laughs> I know! Sop didn't even know what hit him. Ha! <laughs> they breed them special in Alinor, don't they? <laughs> well, that's certainly very interesting. But I'm not sure that there's much in there that I can take action on. Tell our Altmer friend that I'm very sorry. Oh, okay. Goodbye. Man, they did such a good job recreating the Oblivion Castle. Look at this. It's so good. It's like one to one. Damn. Let's wait till morning when the uh, lady should be here. Yeah, it's the Bruma mod. We had to come over here for. Uh, the Dawn Guard quest, the Radiant quested into this area. Hmm? Hello. Hmm. Looks like being the Count of Bruma. It's a complicated task. Let's put it that way. On the one hand, there are the Imperials. On the other, there are the Nords. And then, there are the other cultures to contend with as well. And I'd be remiss if I didn't mention that the Stormcloak Uprising in Skyrim has... complicated things, to a certain extent. But I'm proud to serve Bruma and her people. Um, everyone that was alive in uh, Oblivion's time is now dead. It's been hundreds of years. What can you tell me about Bruma? Bruma is the jewel of the Jeril Mountains. A strong and hardy city. Imperial in name but equally Nordic by blood. And while the county surrounding her is frosty, as Viscount Carvain says, the hearts of our people burn brighter than the warmest hearth. We have our share of problems, I won't deny that. But Bruma is a prosperous county given the times. Compared to Shadenhall and Breville, Bruma might as well be paradise, and at least we were spared the horrors of the Great War, mostly. Um, if a, if a dungeon is flagged as Radiant Ready, then any quest can radiant quest to that dungeon, even vanilla quests. Because that's how the radiant system works. H how does Bruma fare? Well enough, I suppose. The Great War mostly spared Bruma. Thank the Divines for that. Most of Cyrodiil didn't have such good fortune. Uh, we can't get in the Dark Brotherhood area because Coral's not over there. <coughs> Bruma's the only city available. Any troubles facing the city? Not particularly, no. I certainly don't envy my friends across the border in Skyrim, though. These are truly dark times for the Empire. Let us hope that this storm blows over, as of all the rest. But something makes me think this one's different. I fear Tamriel will never be the same again. If it's work you seek, speak with my Viscount, Marcius Carvain. 
He's more likely to have work for you than I. He spends most of his time in the castle. Uh, yeah, you're remembering it wrong. 